The existence of Natanz was revealed in 2002. Officially, it's a project designed to generate electricity. This is the facility at the heart of Iran's dispute with the United Nations Security Council. Some members are concerned that the technology at the plant could be used to produce nuclear weapons. Isfahan became operational in 2004. It's a uranium conversion facility. It was the site of a massive explosion in November 2011. The International Atomic Energy Agency is concerned about certain types of production at the plant that could be used as key components in a nuclear weapon. Boucher went live supplying electricity in September. It should be fully operational within 12 months, and construction there began in 1974. Arak is a heavy water production plant still under construction. Iran says it's designed to produce fuel rods. Gom is Iran's most secretive facility. The country informed the International Atomic Energy Agency it was constructing the plant to enrich uranium up to 20%. Now, uranium, with a concentration of 20% or more, is needed to build nuclear weapons. But Iran insists its nuclear program is designed to meet its energy needs and is entirely peaceful.